In this basic cloning experiment, we begin with a plasmid called P-probe GFPLVA from the Lindau lab. It is a popular cloning plasmid present in many research labs encoding a useful variant of the green fluorescent protein gene. In green, you see the region of the circular DNA that encodes GFP. The black region of the plasmid encodes the origin of replication, antibiotic selection marker, and various other things. In this experiment, we want to transfer just the GFP region into another plasmid called PUC19. This is another common plasmid with a different origin of replication and antibiotic marker. Our experiment will employ PCR, restriction digest, and ligation to construct a new DNA from these two parent plasmids. A construction file describes lab operations for fabricating a genetic construct. In this diagram, we illustrate the various steps of the cloning experiment. First, we'll do a PCR with two oligonucleotides named primer 1 and primer 2 using plasmid DNA called P-probe GFP-LVA as template. This plasmid encodes the GFP gene in green that we wish to move to another plasmid. After PCR, we'll need to digest the product with ECHOR1 and HINDI3. These restriction enzymes will cleave the DNA at the E and H sites. That digestion will result in three fragments, a large one with the gene we want and two very small tails. In the purification step, we'll isolate the fragment containing GFP. Similarly, we need to digest PUC19 with ECHOR1 and HINDI3, and then purify the large backbone fragment containing the origin of replication and selectable marker. Finally, we ligate the GFP cassette and the vector backbone together to make our product, PUC GFP. A construction file is basically a formal way of expressing a cloning experiment. Minimally, it allows you to explain precisely to your computer the experimental plan for documentation. Also, simulating construction files helps catch design errors and thus saves time in the lab. Best of all, software can automate the drafting of construction files for simple experiments. Two pieces of information are needed for a construction file, the list of input sequences and the reactions. This list of sequences for our experiment would include P-probe GFPLVA, PUC19, Primer1, and Primer2. And there are six reactions, one PCR, two digests, two purifies, and one ligate. 